I had never done anything that size and so uh, of that scale and so it was a whole different way of thinking and yet I found it was it was so much fun to paint something that big and have it work the reason I call it my masterpiece is, is because on a lot of different levels I mean it not only was it uh, the biggest undertaking and so forth and but but also what it stands for and 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 it goes along with what I believe and in, in, in what my life's about and in, in which is trying to bring nature's beauty into people's homes you know trying to do things that are powerful in a positive way Virtually anything that touches emotion in me is something that I use in my art. I like to think of myself as a leaf in this river that's going down and bouncing off of rocks and everything. And as long as, I, as I'm able to let myself go, the current's going to take me to the right place. Well, I didn't have to control my destiny because it just happened. It's so interesting because there are some, some collectors that have been back from day one. Every once in a while I'll be doing a show in a gallery and, and they'll walk in and, and say, I bought this painting in you know, 1974. And, uh, and they'll show me a picture of it and I'll go, whoa. And it's weird because I can remember painting that painting, even after thousands and thousands of paintings. And then, of course, there's the relationships where you get to, to be very good friends, um, and the people, they'll come to shows and, and over and over again. Um, and, uh, and it really becomes a personal thing, because art is personal. When you're on a one -to, really on a one-to-one -one with a person who's collecting one of your pieces of art, and it's, and it's gonna make a difference in their home, and most of my collectors, they're those kind of people. They're not just buying it because I'm the flavor of the month, but they're buying it because it does something to them. I'm not just a name, I'm uh, a painter. And that's what I'll always be, as a painter.